Teenagers drive less than most, but they die more often behind the wheel. That one sobering statistic has always worried parents, but now, as Channel 8's Jeff Brady reports, technology is tracking teens no matter when or where they go. Kyle Glanzer is a good driver with a clean record. Still, as a teenager, getting behind the wheel is risky business. According to the federal government, vehicular crashes are the leading killer of Americans between ages 15 and 20. And the number keeps climbing. More than 3,600 teenage drivers killed in auto crashes in 2003. And a statistic like that has almost every parent of a teenage driver concerned. Enter Alltrack, a satellite-aided tracking device that monitors a car's every move. At News 8's request, Kyle and his parents agreed to try it out. Kind of nerve-wracking. Probably made you a little nervous at first. Alltrack costs about $330 plus a monthly fee. He's heading north, isn't he? Right. It uses satellite technology to track the car and notify a parent in real time when the driver violates preset limits such as speed, distance, or location. Yeah, I think it's a great idea. I think actually it's a, it's a good piece of technology. Alltrack is just one of about a half dozen auto monitoring devices now available online. Some sound an alarm or activate a warning light inside the car. Others just collect data to be downloaded later. This is real technology. Rick Carson, a family therapist, suggests that these monitors only be used in the appropriate context. And if it's used as a policing device, there's already been a breakdown in communication that needs to be cleared up. And Carson says penalties have to be enforced. I don't see a problem in it at all, though. Still, for parents who want help monitoring their student drivers, technology has the tools. Mom is always watching. Jeff Brady, Channel 8 News. For more information on how you can track your teen's driving habits, go to WFAA.com.